No. No. Yes. Omiyage, aka Souvenir Snack Foods, are back at Tokyo Disney Resort. So you know what we're going to do today? We're going to head inside Bon Voyage and check out all the delicious snack food. I am excited. <laughs> A few months ago, they took out the omiyage here at Bon Voyage and at the parks you could only buy it through the app. I think it was because of supply chain issues, I'm not sure, but regardless, it is back. So we're going to head inside and check it out and I might have to get something today. And as always, explorers, make sure you stick around to the end of the video where I share with you my pro tip to make your time easier here at Tokyo Disney Resort. Oh, they're doing some construction here. huh? Interesting. Anyway, we're here for the snack food. Let's head on over here. I love that we have our omiyage back and some of them come in these nice tins. Now, I know I did a video like three or four months ago that went over this stuff. So we might see some repeats, but that's okay. It's always fun to look at. So these are little rice crackers and my knees just popped. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get up. <laughs> anyway, there's 30 inside and there. It's 111 yen. And you get this, you get this tin. Look at the design on that. That's fun. So really quick, again, I know for a lot of you that have watched all my merchandise videos, this is an old hat for you. But for those of you that are new, quick price conversion. Drop the last two digits, and that's roughly how much it is in U.S., Canadian, New Zealand, Australian, Singapore dollars. It's about eleven dollars, give or take, right? <sighs> I. <laughs> Anyway, here's my beloved apple pies. There's four in there for $9.50. Ah, yum. Do I buy more? I don't know. They are pricey for what they are, but they're delicious. Oh, I love this. Look at this design. It's like soft on the top too. So these are sembe or rice crackers and they're all shaped like Mickey and there's gonna be different flavors. So there's goma, ebi, uh, shrimp, uh, ao, aosa, uh, that's like a type of seaweed, I believe, if I remember correctly. Shoyu, which is uh, soy, soy sauce. Uh, and I can't read this one. Ume something, I, I'm not sure. But packaging is fantastic. And a quick little lesson. So omiyage, typically it, it means souvenir, but in most cases it means food as a souvenir so when people travel in Japan they will buy omiyage such as this stuff so any like tourist destinations that you go to they're gonna have food that is either famous in that region or they're gonna be packaged really cute and everything and the purpose of this is to bring back for your friends your family co-workers classmates and a lot of stuff is individually wrapped so you can easily give it out to everybody so if you think about it there's 50 in here and for this price, twelve fifty, I mean, you can give it to your entire class and all you had to spend was this much. I mean, that's pretty cost effective if you ask me. And you get to keep the tin. <laughs> it's really nice. And my boys being all cute and stuff. Uh, they, these are rice crackers, by the way. I love that. Is this the same thing? Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> And we got some potato snacks with Winnie the Pooh. Okay. Uh, hunt, or salt and butter. Salted butter. That's fun. And usually, yeah, they'll have the displays that show you what, what's inside of it. I'm going to decide on something to eat today. So I'm going to pick something. So stick around to see what I pick. What are these? Candies? Yeah, little candies. 10 for 800 yen. Okay, I have a lot of feelings about this. A lot of feelings. No, nobody, want, no, nobody wants these, I'm sorry. Nobody wants these, no, let's, no. Yes. There's 16 candies in here for Sarah if you add the gas stove. <laughs> I'm sitting here making myself laugh. Jeez. You <laughs> got some honey. 
Could you imagine if I just said, guys, we're going to try some honey today, and I'm just sitting there drinking honey out of a container? Could you imagine? <laughs> oh, okay. How much is this honey? It's probably a lot. Eh, 930? Sure. It's probably from Canada. Is it from Canada? I think. Yes. It's from Canada. Right up here. Yay! Representing Canada. A lot of people uh, mistake me for being American. I'm, I'm Canadian. <laughs> so, curry. They've had these for a while. There's like a beef and a chicken curry. They think? Yeah. Chicken curry and beef curry. The, the chicken is sweet and the beef is medium spice. That's what it says. So why is there curry? Because this restaurant, well not this, there's a restaurant in Arabian Coast that serves curry. Casbah food court thing. And then they have some curry, some more curry down here. This is from, um, well, because the, well, not because of Country Bear Jamboree, but because of the Hungry Bear restaurant, they specialize in curry. So makes sense, right? What is it, for chicken? Oh. So this is just chicken curry. This one, and one is sweet and one is hot. And we got some miso soup. Look at the little blocks. That's so cute. Four bags for 800 yen. Then we got the tomato soup. Look at the little tomato soup. Mmm. This is one of my favorites. They've had this design for years. I don't know how long, but it, it's been a while. Yeah, there's 27 little bags inside for 850, and it's all little rice snacks, in different flavors. This one is shrimp. This one is dashi shoyu. So like a fish fish sauce and soy sauce. And ika is a squid. These are actually really good. I really love them. And it's very light, easy to pack. And coming over here, we have, they brought the 20th anniversary stuff back. I guess I'm in the rice cracker section. <laughs> I just realized that. More rice crackers. There's 40 in there, 1100 yen. Look at this fun design. Uh, look at that. All the different wrappers. I feel like this is like the Price is Right wheel. <laughs> oh, this is pretty. Again, kind of the standard flavors. Shrimp, soy sauce. What is this? There's 20 in there for 1400 yen. Oh, look at that. Is that Mount Prometheus? Uh, I'd, I'd say so. Gorgeous. Oh, there's some more down here. Oh, my knees. <laughs> there's 11 in there for 1,500 yen. Look at that. These look yum. Uh, these Ebi Senbei shrimp rice crackers. My beloved Tokyo banana. They've had these for a few years now. These are actually quite hefty. They're little sponge cakes that taste like banana. And there's like caramel sauce inside of it. And the little dots are Mickey's. Look at that. So there's eight inside for 1300 yen. Caramel and banana. Oh, yama. Mm -hmm. Where are we now? The cookie section. The mini? No, Mickey. Cookies. 20 inside for 900 yen. All right, what, what flavors are these? Uh, they are flavors. <laughs> uh, da, da, da. There's like a caramel one, I guess. Almond. Anyway, cookies. Oh, uh, these are classic. These have been around forever. I remember showing you these before. There's 10 in there, 460. It's fun packaging. Oh, you can get A more packaged version, or smaller packaged version, I guess. 1100 yen. Ooh. And up here, we got more cookies. Oh, those are fun. Oh, Disneyland and Disney Sea. You can see that there. Disneyland, Disney Sea. 18 in there, 1200 yen. They're all individually packaged. Chocolate topped cookies. Packaging on this stuff is always so gorgeous. 
And we have these soaring cookies. Soaring fantastic flight. There's 37 in there for 1100 yen. That's actually quite hefty. This is, wait. Oh, because I was like, why is this heavy? Never mind, because of the outdoor plastic. Never mind. <laughs> Shh, let's, let, let's not talk about it. But look at the look at the tin. Look guys, look at the tin. Look at the tin over here. Forget what I just said before. <laughs> Journey on the dream flyer. Let your imagination soar. And some more down here. Oh my knees. I'm gonna be saying that a lot now. So there's 16 in total for 1080 yen. So there's vanilla and cocoa. Cocoa. Chocolate. It's fun, Mickey and Minnie. And we have the tin here. Tokyo Disney Resort. Cream filled sandwich cookies. And some more cookies. There's 26 inside, 1800 yen. And look at the little, all the packaging. It's very cute. Remember, it's easy to give out as gifts. nice 101 Dalmatian cookies there's 10 inside for 460 yen that has some adorable packaging <laughs> uh, you don't no, uh, wrong shelf <laughs> you got some more cookies here uh, there's 10 in there 850 yen there is a lot of going up and down here oh my knees some fun packaging for the cookies. Ooh. Let's go over here. Ooh. Some more gorgeous tins. Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. Some little rolled up cookies. There's eight in there for a thousand yen. And we got Tangled. I'm excited for the Tangled ride that is coming to Tokyo Disney Sea in 2023. So there's eight and a thousand, thousand yen. Really excited for this. And we got some more tins, some cookies, 12 for 650 yen. Beautiful. What are these? Oh, they're like little books. 16 and the 1300 yen. That's really fun. Tokyo Disney Resort. Look at that. And then we have, what's this? Oh, this one's cardboard. And we got some, I guess, some sugar cookies. There's 32 in there for 1400 yen. They still have the Mickey Waffle cookies. Look at that. So there's 12 for a thousand yen in there. And they also have crispy churro snacks. That's fun. There's eight in there for 900 yen. Oh. <laughs> We're getting into the chocolates now. So these like the storybook chocolate. So there's four in there for 750 yen. They all have the little stories in here. Packaging on this is stellar. This one is new. I think I showed this a few videos ago, if I remember correctly. Dark orange. Yes. And then we have the dark dark chocolate. Yeah. Dark berry. With Rapunzel and Flynn. And we have these cute tins. Look at that. I like that. Little, little heart chocolates. There's A in there for 600 yen. And more. Look at those little chocolates. Those are tiny. Those are tiny chocolates. But look at the packaging. So this artwork is on a lot of different merchandise. 13 in there for 900 yen. And of course, comes with a nice tin. Beautiful, gorgeous, we love it. Right down here, 
Beauty and the Beast. Snack food tin. Snack food tin. <laughs> Chocolate tin. This is gorgeous. Looks like the book. We have the chocolates in there. It's 15, 1500 yen. Oh, and these chocolates are back. A lot of people wanted me to try this. So that's expensive. 28 for 1700 yen. But look at that packaging. Japanese tea chocolates. Okay, you need this with tea. I think I'll, I'll have to do this proper if I'm going to do this because I'm going to do it with tea. I'll do that another day. And there's some more chocolates down here. Look at that. 21 for 1400 yen. Packaging is always so fun. It's always fun. Chocolate crunch. Chocolate crunch. There's 60 in there. Four, 2600 yen. So there's milk, white, <laughs> I guess some white chocolate, strawberry, and lemon tea. Ooh. These are always very popular. This is big. This is hefty. This is a hefty boy. Hefty. I kind of want it. But I don't know what I'd do with the tin afterwards is my, my issue. Ooh. 28, 1600 yen. Little uh, chocolate crunch. And a very cute little lunch case that you get to keep with it. Look at that. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. I'm getting aggressive, I'm sorry. I'm gonna pop on over here. Got more. Little tin case. These are what mints? Oh. Oh candies. Ramune. Ramune is a candy here in Japan. It's like a little blue candy. It's also that fizzy drink that comes in the glass bottle that has the marble that you push down in. That's what that is. The flavor anyway. Then we got some more 20th anniversary of Disney Sea. I did a vlog back in I think September of the 20th anniversary, so make sure you check that out later once you're done watching here. We got more cookies, cookies in here, and we got some cakes. Packaging is always so cute. It's eight in there for 1,400 yen. I love marshmallows. 14 in there for 1700 yen and it comes in this plastic container of Baymax what flavor it's probably that looks like chocolate in both is that chocolate I can't read it I can't see it uh, chocolate chocolate cream and yeah chocolate cream <laughs> and we got some more of these cookies chocolates who knows who knows? There's A in there for 1200 yen. Then there's six in here for a thousand. These are yokan, is what it's called. And these are heavy. So these are, it's a jelly dessert made out of red bean paste and sugar. And they are hefty. You know what? This is what we're going to try today. We're going to try these. Yes, we are. I'm going to buy these. We're just in the picnic area here outside of Tokyo Disneyland and we're going to try out the yokan. We're going to open this up here. Ooh, and it's very pretty. And I love the packaging on this. This is really adorable. All right, now we're going to open it up. It says to pull it here. Okay. Ugh. And... Ugh. Pull up. Okay. Sort of worked. <laughs> I am not doing too hot with this. <laughs> okay, here we go. There. Good enough. After struggling to get it open, we finally got it. Okay. It's, um, it's very sticky. It smells a little sweet. Mmm. Oops, almost knocked this over. I love red bean paste. It's usually used in desserts. It's not as sweet as I thought it would be, but I can I can definitely taste the sugar in it. And um, the red bean paste, I like it's like a I don't know. It's a coarse texture. This is um yeah, just jelly. 
I really like this. Mmm. Mmm. I recommend this. Highly. Highly recommend it. Here's my pro tip to make your time easier here at Tokyo Disney Resort. Now, park tickets, that's one of the biggest questions, most asked questions that I get all the time. So everything I'm talking about right now, I have a link in the description. Uh, so don't feel like you need to write everything down. Don't worry, I got you covered. But we're gonna go over this really quickly. So right now you can only buy a one a day ticket. And the biggest issue that a lot of people have is their non-Japanese credit card working, not working. So if you have a Japanese credit card, you probably have no issues. But if you have a non-Japanese credit card, like from Canada, US or somewhere else, it may not work on the Tokyo Disney Resort website. I know, it's a pain. So here is how you can buy tickets. Um, <laughs> the most expensive is book a Disney hotel. They do guarantee tickets into the park. Now, for whatever reason, you can book a hotel easier with your foreign credit card than buying park tickets. I don't know, I really don't. <laughs> or another way to buy tickets is going to Family Mart. So you can buy tickets from Family Mart for the parks. They're usually available a month ahead of time. Uh, they get released in the middle of the night, like between 12 a.m. and 6 a.m. I've seen different times. So you just head to Family Mart and check there and you can pay with whatever payment uh, that Family Mart accepts. The other way is if you have a Japanese Disney account and a Japanese line account. Now, if you live in Japan, you know what line is. They have a prepaid Visa card that you can get. So you just uh, sign up for that and put some money on it. And that does work with the Tokyo Disney Resort ticket website. You can buy it right through the app. And I've done that many times and I've had no problems. So that's another way that you can buy tickets. I know it's really complicated and convoluted, but like I said, I have a link in the description that has all this stuff written down for you. Out of all the omiyage that I showed you today, what would you try? What would you buy? And you have to pick one thing, not everything, like me. I would just buy everything. <laughs> but let me know in the comments below with the keyword omiyage so I know that you watched all the way to the end. And I'm gonna put another video up here so you can continue your travel planning for your eventual trip to Tokyo Disney. All right, Explorers, we'll see you in the next video. Bye.